Abby Franklin, played by Sally Carmen, got her hands on a gun from her ex Tez, Stephen Lord, as part of her plan to shoot dead Corey Brent, Maximus Evans. Although she didn't end up going through with it, the weapon found itself in the dangerous hands of vengeful drug lord Harvey Gaskell, Will Miller. Mistaking Natasha Blakeman, Rachel Leskovats, or Leanne Battersby, Jane Danson, Harvey ended up killing her, leaving Coronation Street schoolboy Sam, Jude Reardon, without a mother. He hasn't been able to speak to anyone since seeing his mother's body but he may soon overhear some devastating information surrounding the details of Natasha's murder. Could he break his silence and confront a guilty Abby over the gun? Roy Cropper, David Nielsen, knew about the gun, and his silence on the matter has left him feeling unbearably guilty. During Monday's episode of the ITV soap, the knowledge became too much for him to cope with and he made plans to leave Weatherfield. When Abby came to thank him for lying to the police, she asked if he was okay. No, the beloved cafe owner replied. I've just been speaking to Detective Sergeant Tom Otty. I know, the bereaved mother responded. Roy explained, don't worry. I've lied, to her and to myself, again. Abby tried to apologize, explaining how sorry she was. I don't know how I can ever pay you back for what you've done for me, she remarked, adding, but if Terry's anything you can't, the devastated Cobble's favorite cut in. He went on, what I did for you makes me deeply ashamed. I'd like you to leave me alone please. Speaking to his niece Nina Lucas, Molly Gallagher, later, Roy's guilty conscience was still tormenting him. I lied to them again, something it appears in becoming quite adept at, he told her. He informed Nina about the gun which killed Natasha being the same one Abby was in possession of. You can't just keep blaming yourself, Nina advised as he ominously stated, I'm not. It seems Roy can't deal with his own guilt as well as his niece's involvement. Dot meanwhile, Sam still couldn't bring himself to communicate with his concerned family. Being smart for a 10-year-old, Sam could try to focus his efforts on finding out exactly why his mother died. He might begin to investigate residents and tune into their conversations while remaining silent. If he overhears Abby, Roy or Nina discussing the gun in upcoming episodes, he is bound to be hit with another blow. The troubled child might find his grief is replaced with anger. It's possible Sam could turn them into the police himself after recording a conversation. Could Abby, Roy and Nina end up in prison after Sam's digging? It seems plausible the smart youngster might be looking for answers and once he gets them, he might start to open up. Wanting justice for his mother, he might finally break his silence by telling his dad Nick Tilsley, Ben Price, and police officers what he knows. Will the trio end up in big trouble? Or could Sam be talked into turning a blind eye to Abby's actions, as she was also lost in grief at the time? It seems the schoolboy is in for more drama either way. As viewers hope the youngster manages to come to terms with Natasha's death, they will probably hope he can put the horrible event behind him and go back to being himself. Coronation Street continues on Wednesday at 7.30pm on ITV.